with all Casey's idea, actually. So can you tell us about how you kind of came up with the idea, if there was a story behind well, it? <laughs> my stuff usually comes to me late at night when I'm half asleep and slightly intoxicated. I, I don't know, but I usually I just am laying in bed and I get weird imagery. And I always, you know, I've always wanted to shoot something in like a solid colored room. And since your show's now on pink, I thought it'd be fitting to do a pink room. Hello, hello. How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? We're doing good. So today we're sitting in the set that um, Casey actually came up with. I came up with this idea late at night, uh, and this sounds so cliche, but I really come up with my ideas like when I'm like in a half dream state. I don't know if it's a muse or what it is that feeds me weird ideas, but I, you know, the initial the initial idea was to do you know a pink room because it's nylon pink. Uh, you know, and have like windows with elephants sticking their heads in and midgets blowing fire and the girls were going to be flying through the air <laughs> with champagne and it was going to be really cool. Um, but it just didn't work out, mostly because they didn't buy the props. Um, <laughs> but other than that, <laughs> it was, yeah, we got the room built. Um, no, it was fine. And we got, we got here and it was cool because we had some stuff and, it's, and that's what I like is I love improvising on set and you know, you have an idea for three weeks, a month of what you're gonna do and you have every detail plan, you get there and you throw everything out and you just draw from aspects of it and you create something totally new. So but, do you have any dream subject, like somebody you really wanna shoot who captures like your essence? Um, <laughs> you know, there, I mean, there's a lot of bands I love because I, I love music and I recently got to shoot uh, Mike Ness from Social Distortion and okay. that, and he was like, uh, it was a dream of mine as a kid, you know, I, I grew up listening to Social Distortion and I was so stoked when I got to shoot him and meet him and he was a super cool guy and the shoot went well, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I always thought it'd be cool to shoot an 80s rocker and I got to shoot Sebastian Bach okay, and tell us about that, that, yeah. that was fun. I had Sebastian Bach in my living room and it was just funny, we were just sitting around with a guy and him telling stories about shooting harpoon guns in Catalina Island and killing dolphins and stuff. Oh I'm sure I'm sure it was fictional, but yeah. it was a, it, at least it was entertaining, you know, like hanging out. The he just had great stories and we had a great night. Yeah, in the middle of the shoot, you know, like he really wanted a pizza, and so I had to send my assistant get a pizza and 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 some Modelo beer, and so like like in the What's mid in, like it's like some some Mexican beer. Oh, okay. Um, so Modelo like, especial. Modelo? But yeah, he, he wanted Modelo. I was like, go get a model, I guess. So. so you also shot the Donnas, right? Yeah, that. that was cool. Their bitchin' album was about to come out, so I had to take them and you know sort of show this attitude. And they were drawing from like that '80s metal scene, and so like the idea was you know to style them up cute, but then put them in like tough leather jackets. And it was it was spooky because the pipe organ was playing like while we were shooting. Wow. So it was like, you're in this. No, there was someone rehearsing. But <laughs> we're, we're in this church, and there's like all this blaring pipe organ. It's like you know it's exactly what you expect. The fan of the opera is going to swing out next, you know. But that was a cool shoot, and it was a lot of fun. So what are some bands you listen to? Kevin Shields is my favorite, uh, and he's putting my bloody Valentine back together, which I'm really excited about. I guess really? the, I guess the rumor has it they're supposed to play at Coachella this year. Mm. I would like to photograph them. Guar, you know, I got right. to shoot them too. That was really fun. Right. You but did. Yeah, I shot I shot Guar on the uh, Guar and CKY on the Viva La Bands tour uh, back in November. It was really cool. They're crazy. Look, like uh, I know they're yeah. it's they're. they're Awesome costume, and up close, there's the costumes are just so freaky. Because you oh think God. it's the kind of thing you think like you see it from stage, but seeing it up close, it's still so detailed. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. It, the weirdest part was walking into their dressing room at, um, at the theater and seeing like just all you know their head, Odorous's head sitting there. Like I was like, what the hell? <laughs> you know, <laughs> like. Where are you the head? Like, yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want to like... give a shout out to my girl. Uh, <laughs> no. Um, Check, check out my website, caseycurry.com. Um, that's www. And in case some of you aren't savvy with that whole thing, I'm not. Uh, Casey Curry, C A S E Y. That's hot. That's really hot. Open your face up towards me. Yeah, keep it like that. You keep doing it. Absolutely. Okay, yeah. That's great. Coaster! Coaster!